Hi, I'm Sheila Ray Gregoire from To Love, Honor and Vacuum with another video blog for you today about marriage. A lot of my posts on my blog are about marriage. I write about marriage. I have a new book called The Good Girl's Guide to Sex that's coming out next year, which I'm really excited about. And I am really passionate about keeping marriages together. But I know that a lot of you are finding your marriage is really just boring. It's blah. You have a lot of issues with your husband that just never seem to quite get resolved. And so today I want to give you one quick tip that you can do to make your marriage better. Focus on the Family came out with a study recently that said that the average couple spends about 27 minutes a week, 27 minutes a week, talking about relationship issues, talking, actually truly communicating about how they feel about each other. Every other time they talk, it's about errands or who's going to pick up the milk or who's going to drive Johnny to karate or who's going to worry about the mom's uh, last doctor's appointment. And you're not actually talking about relationship issues. So it's no wonder that we start to feel disconnected. When you get married, you're totally in love. You do all kinds of fun things together. You're, you're completely on the same page. But then these little things, little by little, start to take over and we start to drift apart. It is really hard to drift together you're only ever going to drift apart. If you want to feel closer together, you actually have to do things together. So if you're having issues with communication and you don't feel like your husband and you really communicate, if you're having issues with sex and you don't feel like the sex is as great as it could be or you feel like he's making too many demands on you, no matter what the issues are in your marriage, I think they can be solved with one quick thing. When was the last time you really laughed together? When was the last time you remember truly enjoying being together? Now I want you to get that image in your head and now here's what I want you to do. I want you to go and do it again. So often we do these fun things and we have a great time but then we stop doing them because life gets in the way. Ladies, once you have kids, especially once you have kids, your primary relationship is with your husband. Other people are relying on you now to keep your marriage together so don't let it drift. Think about what you did that made you laugh and go and do it again, even if it takes time away from the karate lessons, even if it takes time away from the grocery shopping. Your marriage is the number one thing. Spend some time having fun and you'll probably find that all the other issues diminish in importance.